Hi Crafting Friends, I'm Pebbles. Welcome to my channel, Qualitas Creations. I upload a video every Tuesday at 6 a.m. Central Standard Time. If you are not a subscriber to my channel, please click the subscribe button. I would like you to join my group of crafting friends. I hope everyone had a wonderful weekend. Today, I have an awesome Dollar Tree haul. Don't get disappointed if your Dollar Tree doesn't have all these products. It's okay. I honestly went to, I think, five different Dollar Tree stores in five different locations. Actually, I could be a little more honest. Five different cities. <laughs> but I had a good time spending the day going from city to city, checking out different Dollar Trees. And at the end, I have this wonderful Dollar Tree haul. So let's get started on this Dollar Tree haul. First, I'll show you the different signs they have at the Dollar Tree. This one says, Happy Halloween. And this one says, Trick or Treat. I believe this is supposed to be a haunted house. And I also have a jack-o'-lantern. They also have different ornaments. Color your own ornament. It's a cat. A jack-o'-lantern. And ghosts. I found this cute pumpkin decor. This one happens to be orange with black spots. They also had purple, but I preferred it an orange for fall. Witch hat picks. Foam bones. This cute bow headband. It reminded me of Minnie Mouse, so I thought, oh, this is really adorable. I need to pick this up. And they also have the metal words, Haunted, Spooky, and Beware. Looks like this. I'll take this out of the package so you can actually see what it looks like. I didn't purchase a lot of Halloween stuff because I don't decorate a lot for Halloween. I decorate more for fall. Here's Beware. Spooky and Haunted. There's more Halloween decor and crafts items at the Dollar Tree. These are just the few items that I decided to pick up. I'll be right back and we'll get started with the Day of the Dead. Hey everyone, I'm back. And I'll show you what I bought at the Dollar Tree. They have this Day of the Dead decor. It's so adorable. If you can see that. Here's another sugar skull with a little top hat. And then another sugar skull with a flower. I noticed they had this really adorable Day of the Dead material at the Dollar Tree for only a dollar. So I picked some up and I'll let you see what it looks like. I think these sugar skulls are absolutely adorable. I'm doing this video in sections because I purchased so many items <laughs> at these Dollar Trees. So I'll be right back. Okay, okay I'm back. And now I'll show you the fall slash autumn decor. I think it's so adorable. I found this. It says thankful. I just think sunflowers are absolutely gorgeous. And then it says thankful. 
I don't know if I'm even going to change this. This is so cute just by itself, and it was only a dollar. I purchased eight inch wreath rings and it comes in two pieces. I'll move them apart so you can see. And I'm thinking about making some wreaths this year for my front and back door. I want them a little smaller so they're not huge. And I know a lot of people use different materials, but I want to use tool. So I found this really pretty orange tool more like a gold color tool and this tool is really pretty it has different leaves on it i don't know if you can tell with my lighting I'm just gonna move it around so one of my projects is definitely going to make these wreaths so you'll have to watch that video some people use decorative mesh for their wreaths and i might do that for a Christmas one, I found this really pretty red. I'll probably purchase it in green and white too to make a Christmas wreath, but that's for later. I also found these mini hay bales. Oh my gosh, are they adorable or what? They're so cute. Then I have this pumpkin, P for Pebbles. That gets really cute. I'm gonna set it right here. They also have these Harvest DIY pens, and they're so cute. If you look on the back, you can tell they're actually like clothespins. You have to decorate it yourself. So this one happens to be pumpkins. I'll move it this way so you can see it a little better. I don't know if this is supposed to be apple pie or pumpkin pie, but either way, it sounds delicious to me. And the little trucks are so cute. They have little pumpkins. For my wreath, I think what I'm going to do is use this bow because it's already made. I mean, how they have Isla Fall, most of all. That is so cute. And there's different colors, different sayings, just whatever one you want to look at. I think they're just really cute oh I love stickers and these stickers are absolutely cute check out these stickers they're so nice I really like them I don't know if I want to put them on a card or a journal but I'll figure out something <laughs> set that aside here's some more decor oh my goodness football season you know that's coming up <laughs> And then there's three little pumpkins. I like this decor, but I'm thinking I might make something with these pumpkins and this football. But you'll have to see on another video. I also have this decor. They're really cute. They're little scarecrows. I don't know if I want to put this on my wreath or use it for something else. I'll have to think about it. And then I'll, you'll see on the next video what I decided to do with these. This is really cute. I absolutely love this. It says grateful, thankful, and blessed. Isn't that the truth? Now I did find some metal words. Thankful, harvest, and welcome. I'll open this up so you can actually see what it looks like. It's hard to see it this way, so just give me a quick second and I'll pick this out. Here's the first one. It says harvest. And then we have thankful. And welcome thinking about using this welcome on my um, wreath for my front door. I'm not sure if I want to keep it the metal color like this or if I want to use some Rust-Oleum and paint it, but you'll have to see next video. 
I also found this family. I think this is absolutely cute. Here, let me move this so you can see it a little better. Put this over. And home. Over at the Dollar Tree, they have different types of um, ribbon. And this ribbon I thought was absolutely adorable. Now, I like owls. I think they're cute. I like owls, pumpkins, leaves, anything autumn. Of course, I was born in September, so I love fall. Fall is like my favorite season of all time. And this is what this looks like. It's so cute. I'll kind of move it around. And now, let's see. I did find a couple other signs. Happy Harvest. I think this is adorable. And this sign is really cute. They have different letters. So if you're looking for, you know, either your first name or your last name, this is just really cute. I'm not sure if I'm going to change this a little bit. Um, I might change this ribbon. I'm not sure. I'll have to check it out on another video. We have thankful and blessed. Absolutely love this. It's so cute. Gather together. I have to say, Thanksgiving is my favorite holiday. This pumpkin is really cute. I'm thinking maybe, let me grab this for just a second. What do you think about this? Really cute, isn't it? Maybe paint it, put this on, a little decorations, a little sunflower maybe. Another video idea. Mm -hmm. I just have all these ideas. I have so many things from the Dollar Tree. It's just like idea overload. Oh my goodness, so much fun. Then we have an acorn. A leaf, a fall leaf, that's so cute. Another pumpkin, this one's a little different design if you can see. I'll move it like this so you can see it a little better. Oh my goodness, look at this owl, isn't it adorable? You could like totally put little eyes right here, and that could be their glasses. Oh, so cute. <laughs> And then, I really like this one. It already has writing on it. It says thankful. You just need to paint it and decorate it a little bit. How easy is that? This one's really cute, too. It says welcome. And I like this one also. It says welcome fall. Thank you for spending time with me today. I hope my video inspires you to do some DIY crafts. And if you have a Dollar Tree in your area, I encourage you to find some Dollar Tree decor and craft ideas. If you liked my video, please give me a thumbs up and add a positive comment at the bottom. If you find some really cute Dollar Tree items and I didn't put them on this video, please comment below because I might have to stop at the Dollar Tree and maybe pick up a few more items. So, I will see everyone next Tuesday for another fun crafting project. I hope everyone has an awesome rest of the week. Stay positive and keep crafting. Bye, my crafting friends!